Welcome back to my corner of the internet, guys. I am the Lucid Dream, and I was not planning on making another video tonight. However, I just saw that Press NH Now had been arrested, and words cannot describe how much I cannot stand this guy. The sound of his voice is like pouring acid on my soul. I cannot stand listening to him, which is why I don't cover or say much about him. But this is too good to pass up. First and foremost, thank you to all of my channel members and subscribers. Without you, I would not be here. So as always, every day, thank you. Let's go ahead and get into it. How you doing? Hello. Oh, yeah. are you the, who are you? What do you mean? Who, who? I'm here to get some public information. That's all. Okay. Oh, you're looking at the badge? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm not a police officer. Okay. Yeah, no. All right. I, public information? Yeah. From, from who in particular? Nowhere in particular, just Department of Health. You have to come, you, you have to go back out to the desk. Why is that? Are there who offices? Are you, who are you with? Just, just me. No, you can't just roll through um, this office. Is this a, is this a hallway? Like a public hallway? No, it is an inside of the Department of Health and Human Services. Okay. This is our building. It's not your building. It's the people's building. Okay, the people's building. So the, we let me say we have a process for visitors. They stop at the front desk. Uh -huh. They sign in. Okay. They get a badge. They say who they are here to see. And that is our public building process yeah. that we use. I don't want to go by that policy. Well, then you have to go back out. No, not at all. I'm here to get some public information and so ask some what questions. what I'd like to do is... Can I have your name, first of all? Like, I'm you... Helen Carlson Harris, Commissioner of okay. Health and Human Services nice. for the City of Springfield. Do you have a business card? I do. Can I have but, one? Maybe you get a chance. First... I'll meet you over there. What's your name? Ann Kissel, Deputy Commissioner for Health and Human Services. Okay. So you, this is the desk that you stop at, right here. Okay. And uh, this is Ashley. Be happy hey, Ashley. to give you um, any information that you need as far as this building is concerned. Just happy to do that for you. Yeah. But individuals can't just walk out. Did you bus him in? Yes. Okay. And so individuals can't just walk off the street and walk through our... Of course department. they can. If they have business here, they can, yeah. And what business do you have here, sir? I've already told you. Uh, could you repeat it, please? Yeah, to get some public information. What public information can I, you I don't you? know yet. I don't know. I haven't looked around. I... That is... So, you want public information, but you're not sure of what public information yeah, you want. It depends on... And you want to roam the halls of this The public publicly accessible areas, yes, correct. Uh, without telling us I don't your need purpose. It. I just did tell you my purpose three times now. To get public information. Yes. And so this is to take pictures, to take video, to get some public information. Can yeah. Do me a favor, call. I am actually baffled how anyone deals with this man on a day to day basis, like interacts with him in his real life. Like all he would have to do is open his mouth and I would want to punch him in the face. That's how bad his voice is to me. Like, can you hand me the butter? Smack. That's how it would happen. It would be uncontrollable. It, it, he is that insufferable to me. The entitlement and the pissiness in his voice is just, ugh, it, it's so bad. I do find it interesting that he wears a badge, because as much as he wants to say he's not impersonating an officer, I don't know if that's exactly true. If he is just walking down the hallway and someone walks by him and sees a badge on him, they're not going to stop and get close enough to see what it says. So I'm sure that is something he uses to his advantage. Don't go any further, please. I'm not going oh, in her oh, office. Yeah. That's her private office. I got that. I know the rules. But you're filming her, her private office. I'm not in her office. Sir, it's... Can I, I just need a business card. That's all. Does she give her permission to be able to? No. To be here? I don't need your permission. I didn't say here. I said in her office. I'm not in her office. Let's get that straight. No, door. I'm not in her office. What's going on? Don't spread lies. I asked her to close the door. That's not a lie. No, you said that I was in her office. She's calling. Who is he? Where is he from? 
I just need a business card from her, if possible. Business cards. Oh, there you go. Thank you. I appreciate it. You're welcome. Yeah. You're the uh, commissioner, you said? That's right. Okay. Do you have a business card since you're the... You're yeah, under, yeah, my, she's under you, right? Everyone in this department is... Okay, cool. Excuse me, hello. Yes. Do you have a business card? Actually, you can no, go mine is downstairs, though. Okay. Do you want me to meet you down there, or you want to come back up, or... No. You don't want to get me a business card? Mm -hmm. You can follow the commissioner. You can reach anyone up in my staff uh, through me, and you have through my you. business card. Okay. Okay? Yeah, cool. I mean, so exactly, like, what do you guys do here? Like, people come in here to make appointments, or... This is the Springfield Department of Health and Human Services. Okay. We are the Board of Health for the Commonwealth of Massachusetts okay. for the City of Springfield. There are various operations that go on yeah. here. We do serve the public. Okay. We have nursing services here for our residents. We also have environmental health services here, inspecting other restaurants and doing other public yes. health work. So okay. our, our work is very broad. Yeah. Um, our work is intentional. Our work is uh, very specific to yeah. the residents of the city of Springfield. Okay. All right. Well, I appreciate it. I mean, that's pretty much a lot of the information I kind of need to know. Certainly. I feel like it went right over his head when she says that their work is very specific to the residents of the city of Springfield, which he is not. Certainly. Yeah. Um, is it PD on the way? Because I don't want to run away from them. I mean... I, 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 I'll speak with them. I, I have no problem with I that. I told them that I would give you an opportunity to leave. Um, you haven't asked me to leave. Please leave. I, I think I'll wait for them. Okay. I'll yeah. tell them. Yeah, because this is a public office and I am here to get public information. So, let them see what they say. Um, she's, she's here. Can you not film in her private office, though? Three. I can record in there. I'm not in there. That's how that works. There you go. Like, create your privacy. Miss, you can come with me. And who are you? Who are you? What? Do you work here? Yeah, I work. Okay, I'm just curious. You don't need to go in there either. It says employees only. Okay, so yeah. I'm not going in there. Cut it out. I know I know where I'm supposed to go and where I'm not supposed to go. Stop. Cut it out. Please stay in the public area. Yeah, well, thank you. Oh, I will stay in the public area. I will stay in the public area. Thank you. Yeah, so I don't know why the police are being called if I'm in a public area. Because you were asked to leave. Yeah, you can't tell me to leave just because I'm recording in here and getting public information. I don't care what she said. And you are going to learn today. You really are. Watch. And that statement is going to age like milk here very soon. You know, the thing with most of these assholes, I'm not going to say all, there might be one or two that the exception to the rule, but most of these assholes, the behavior and the attitude, the entitlement, that's the problem here. Because if this was a true audit, if you were coming in as a neutral observer and you were not interacting, your results are going to be very different than the ones that these guys get. And that's because they create these interactions. The entitlement, the pissiness, the superiority complex that these morons have, that creates this interaction. Not once in 44 years have I ever felt the need to wander around in a public building in places that I don't need to be in because it's stupid. I have better things to do with my time. This moron doesn't. So he creates this negative interaction for YouTube to quote-unquote expose corruption when there is no corruption here. There is a jackass wandering around the Department of Health and Human Services treating people like shit because he thinks he can. What are you going to do if everyone just stops entering public service because they get treated like this? You're going to understand. 
I've been nothing but polite in here. I've been nothing but respectful. I told you what I was here for. Mm -hmm. And I'm in the public areas. So make sure you tell that to the PD when they come, okay? Well, you were asked to leave. You can't leaving. ask me to leave. I haven't committed any crime. Well, we did ask you to leave. For what purpose? Because... Yeah, I'm Enlighten me. It, what, I'm for, not why are you asking me to leave? Because I'm recording? No, I never said that. I didn't bring up anything about the recording. So why are you asking me to leave? Because I'm here to get public information? Cause because the two things that I'm doing. Because the commissioner asked you to leave. Okay. And you don't know why she asked me to leave? It's at her discretion. No, okay. no it's not. Employee. It's I'm really not, employee. though. You're my employee. Remember that. I know. I laugh. When you cash those checks, remember, it's the taxpayer's money. So can I just ask you why you're asking me to leave? Is it because I'm recording? I'd rather get a better understanding on why. Maybe I can make a determination. Can you give me your name or no? No. Okay. I don't think I have to do that. Okay. Um, does it involve like a... Can I ask you again why you're asking me to leave? And maybe I could determine on if it's suitable? No? Okay. That's what I thought. So where are the public accessible areas? Because I don't see any signs or anything like that. This waiting room? This is all public? Okay. That's it? Unless so, you have an appointment here. Okay. So what? what's down there? Are there like, other public offices down there? Is it just... It's offices. Okay. It's offices. Uh, where are there employees here, here who work yeah. here? Okay. Work. Those are their offices. Okay. They probably have better things to do. You can't trespass somebody in a public building just because you want to. You know that, right? They have to be committing a crime in order to do so. You do understand, Commissioner, that you can't you can't demand somebody to leave a public office, right? Unless they've committed a crime. I haven't committed any crimes. I'm not here to commit any crimes. I mean, that face and that voice is a crime against humanity. But other than that, he isn't following the safety and security protocols of the building. He can be asked to leave because of it. You have cameras in here? I didn't give you guys permission, but you're recording me. How ironic. trend nobody's caused nobody's caused the scene except for them yes sir how you doing good how are you all right all right youtube thing huh all right so you gotta go why is that because this is not a public building what do you mean I, is this you the, see how the door locks and you get buzzed in i had no idea no. okay it's not a public oh, building he just told you that. they offer public services yeah that's what i'm here for i need okay i need to get some more well, now services. they don't want to give you service so you, they, they can't refuse services they can they can well, they can, can i ask you why they can they did can i ask you why you have to figure that out with them can you call a sergeant for me no all right let's go outside can you call a sergeant we're gonna go don't outside don't touch me outside, you're going to jail don't we're gonna touch go outside can i ask you for what because we're asking you to leave now you're trespassing are you asking me are you Give me a lawful order. I'm a lawful order. order. What would be the crime? Huh? What would be the crime? Trespassing. Trespassing. How so? Go watch. Can you not fucking touch me? Get out of the building. Don't touch me. Okay. You want to touch me, you piece of I shit? Did. Go. You. Go. You. What's your name and badge number? Right there. You can read Get it. The right off me, dude. I'm gonna. F Get you off back. the property. No. I can stay right here. No. It's a f public sidewalk. It's a public sidewalk. It's a public sidewalk. I'm outside of the building. 
Yeah, I'm outside the building. I'm outside of the building, sir. You told me to leave, I left. I was going on the property. property. I'm trying to go on. I could be on this property. Can you call the lieutenant, please? No. Yep. You'll see him inside. And now he's going to get to the e-begging. The only reason this video exists, the only reason any of his videos exist, for you to give him money. Um, I did retain an attorney. Uh, well, I'm in the process of retaining an attorney. Uh, he actually does watch a lot of auditing and auditors around the country. Uh, he's very familiar in what we do and how to handle these type of cases. So um, if you would like to help support and donate to my channel, I would appreciate that very much. Uh, there's obviously no obligation. Uh, it does cost money to f fight and win these cases. Um, all the information, like I said, is in the description, top comment, and in this video. If you'd like to help support, redress, and or petition your government, would be greatly appreciated. Um... Yep, I'm going to get right on that. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Please like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you would like to see. I'm going to leave you with a bonus clip of Alaska Audits doing what he does best, which is absolutely nothing, but posting a 34-second video because apparently his phone ran out of film again. I will catch you on the next one. Oh, no, 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 this is a parking lot right here. Oh, no, sir, 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 sir. This is a sidewalk right here, so let me help educate you. I'm not moving a fucking inch off of this sidewalk right here. We never set off the sidewalk. Okay, all right, this is a sidewalk right here. I'm not moving a fucking inch. Not one. Not one fucking inch. Good. Because this is a dominating pig right here. You. Right there, sir. Oh, sir, could could you step over here and uh, give me your name and your badge number, please?